here at EAA Oshkosh with uh, Jackie Canlon, Senior Director of Marketing for Piper Aircraft. Thanks for being with us, Jackie. Thank you. Thanks for stopping by. Can you uh, tell us a little bit about the airplane that's behind us, the new, uh, the new Piper 100? Yeah, actually behind me, as you just stated, is the Piper Pilot 100. And this is kind of our latest aircraft to enter into the marketplace. What's interesting about this aircraft is the whole objective was to come up with something that was a lot more cost effective and a little less lower price point than some of the other aircraft that are out there for flight schools. So the goal was to come up with a price point that would attract all flight schools, not just the larger, well-funded university programs. So the Pilot 100 starts out at $259,000 for the VFR version, or if you want one that's instrument equipped, that's roughly $289,000. And uh, today we announced that we have already received about 100 orders since we originally announced the aircraft, which was just back in April of this year, so not very long ago. Yeah, that's a great success in the, uh, in the near term. Yeah, are, you, are you finding uh, more large schools, small schools, a mix of flight schools in terms of your yeah, customer base? Great question. Primarily, it's actually smaller flight schools that were really looking for a new aircraft to replace their aging training aircraft. And so, and that was really the goal. That's the people we really wanted to talk to. There is one exception, and that would be ATP, which is a very large and well-known flight school. They placed an order for 50 of these aircraft. Wow, so you're, you're getting both ends of the market we are, at the we same are. time. Right, that's exactly right. That's good. The airplane, uh, avionics-wise, we're looking at a, a Garmin system on board? That is correct. It's the Garmin G3X system. And for the engine, a lot of people think, well, you've got the light coming in there. We actually don't. This actually has the Continental Prime IO370 engine. Okay, so you've got the Continental engine, yep. the Garmin, and the third seat in the back, it looks like, on yep. your shoulder there in the, uh, in the 100i. That is correct. The third seat is an option in the Pilot 100 and is standard in the 100i. Okay. Is that used for uh, instructors sitting in the back as crew coordination? Or, I think it's a lot for observ observation. There's observe. such learning is you learn great best by observing and so very often in instrument programs flight schools will want to have the opportunity for another student to observe a lesson. Yep, that sounds great. Well, congratulations on your success with the new model. Thank you so much and thanks for stopping by. Thank you. Bye-bye.